Back and forth 2v1s is a possessional style two versus one drill that really helps players work on getting past defenders, making through runs, making combination plays happen. And it's a very, very easy drill to administer. Basically, all you need to do is set up a rectangular grid and then have two lines on either side. The drill starts off with two players starting against one defender, and basically they need to get past that defender. One thing that I always recommend as a coach is that the player with the ball tries to commit the defender, and if that defender commits to them, then they can play a ball off to their teammate. If the defender does not commit to them, then they have space themselves to take the ball to the other side. We've already talked about the importance of committing defenders in our Andres Iniesta video. So if you haven't seen that one, it's definitely worth checking out as it is one of our favorite videos on the channel. Andres Iniesta is a master at creating space for himself and his teammates. So he's definitely a legendary player that we can all learn a lot from. To keep a nice flow to this trill, the player that plays the ball in to the opposite side is the player that stays on to defend against the next wave of two attackers coming in the opposite direction. This way there's a nice flow to this drill and it never really ends because the player that plays it in is always staying on ready for that next wave here you can see the drill in action and you can see that the players constantly have to decide whether they want to try to keep the ball themselves or play it off to a teammate it's a really great drill to work on decision making in those central areas on the pitch and in addition if you want to make this drill more difficult you can try to do it with tighter and tighter spaces if you play this drill in a large space that makes it much much easier for the attackers because the defender has to cover a lot more ground if the ball goes out of play or if a player loses the ball, the player that lost the ball is the player that's going to stay on and be a defender against the next group. Once players really get the hang of this 2v1 and are finding it easy to get past that defender, you can also make this drill a bit more challenging by having both players stay on and creating a 2 versus 2, which would be the next progression and is going to make this drill a little bit more difficult. Overall, learning how to combine with teammates and get past defenders is a very, very important skill in football, especially for midfielders or people playing in those central areas trying to maneuver past opponents so this drill i highly recommend for midfielders or even forwards in the attacking third learning how to commit defenders those are very very important skills to work on